Good morning to all. I am starting today's lecture and uh, I want to share my PPT on your screen. Friends, can you able to view my screen well? Sir. Thank you, Prajakta. Okay, friends, this is the last application we study in detail in last lecture. That is the application of the operational amplifier as a substractor. This is the schematic diagram where the operational amplifier can be going to work as the substractor. This is designed a circuit in which both the inverting and non-inverting inputs are used to give to reach the inputs V1 and V2 to the inverting as well as non-inverting input. There will be the negative feedback will be used that is the output will be fading back to the inverting input terminal through the resistance REF. There will be V1 is the one of the out input which is measured with respect to inverting and ground. V2 is the other uh, input voltage which is measured across the non-inverting and ground and R1 and R2 are going to make the potential divider though that is the voltage across the R2 is uh, fading to the uh, terminal that will be the non-inverting terminal or the positive terminal. And according to this design, the last uh, statement is the if R1 is equal to R2 is equal to R3 and REF, that is R1, R2, R3 and REF are equal to R, then V0 that will be the output voltage here observed of output voltage is the difference between two voltage that is the V2 minus V1. V2 minus V1, V2 is the greater, V1 is the smaller and the difference between them is uh, visualized, it will be observed at the output of the operational amplifier that is the V0 and such a, this application will be known as a substractor. Then friends, we are switching to the next uh, application. And that application will be nomenclatured as a operational amplifier as a differentiator. See toward the nomenclature that is the heading of the point that is the op amp as a differentiator. Means that we actually know that that is the operational amplifier is a personally differential amplifier. Basically it is differential amplifier. But the designing of the differential amplifier, it is used to operate, used to, uh, used to response for the, or used to perform the different operations of the mathematics that will be the addition, subtraction, multiplication, division, as well as the, uh, as well as the differentiator, integrator, exp exponential, polynomial, trigonometrical and so on, logarithmic and on. It means that basically, basically operational amplifier can be worked uh, to perform different mathematical process. And while performing the mathematical per uh, process, basically the function principle of a differential amplifier it will be used up and hence this differential amplifier is used as an operational amplifier because it is used to perform the different mathematical operations okay here this is the explanation this is the diagram and principle where the operational amplifier will be acting as the differentiator that will be the rate of change, it will be known as a differentiator. The rate, rate of change of y with respect to t, that will be known as a dy by dt. 
that is the derivative change of y with respect to change with respect to change in time that will be known as an dy by dt that will be known as an dy by dt basically friend just wait for a while don't know जस्ट वी आर डिस्कसिंग द operational amplifier and operational amplifier basically used to perform the mathematical operations like the addition subtraction multiplication division exponential differentiation and uh, integrator and so on means here we are using the basically differential amplifier which is going to uh, nomenclature as the operational amplifier because this operational amplifier can be used to perform the different mathematical operation here we are discussing the operational amplifier as a differentiator okay differentiation means here operational amplifier can be used to perform the rate of change of two physical quantity means that consider if y is changing with respect to t for a while consider t is the time and y is the displacement then the rate of change of displacement with respect to time it will be noted by mathematical formula dy by dt and dy by dt is the rate of change of displacement with respect to time and that function that physical quantity it will be known as a differentiator like that if we are going to calculate the rate of change of two different physical quantity with respect to each other then we are performing the process of the differentiation and here by method by the electronic process process of the signaling we are going to performing the process of mathematics we know that in physics we are going to use different mathematical process different mathematical operations like the trigonometric operation the integration differentiation and so on here using differential amplifier that is the one of the electronic circuit we are going to perform the process of mathematics of the differentiator means here differentiation operation of the differentiation can be performed by electronic mode by electronic circuit and that is the differential amplifier or simply it will be known as an operational amplifier here that is op amp as a differentiator and following circuit will be shows how the operational amplifier can be used as a differentiator okay means that this circuitry here it will be shown just i am taking the lesser okay see here this is the design or the this is the electronic circuit where the operational amplifier can be used as a differentiation or the differentiator we know that in operational amplifier there are two terminal one is a inverting terminal that will be shown by negative sign other is the non inverting terminal it will be shown by positive sign but here see keenly the non inverting terminal that will be connected to positive sign it will be grounded means that non inverting terminal is grounded and we know that when the non inverting terminal is grounded inverting terminal acts as visually ground visual ground we see the uh, in last lecture we uh, see in detail the concept of the visual ground visual ground means it acts like the earth means it that terminal will be acts how it will be connected to the earthing it will be acts like that okay see here here the input terminal will be vt vt is the voltage at a time instant t at a moment t means the for time if we starting from the zero that will be v0 if we start we uh, measured at it after 2 second that will be simply voltage after 2 second means here vt is the 
pulse and that pulse is measured with respect to time in how much second how much the voltage amplitude that will be the moment means the voltage amplitude for a respective time that is the vp see here the inverting voltage it, it will be connected to directly the capacitor here is the capacitor and again the here feedback we know that the process of the feedback feedback is the process of injecting some part of the output some fraction of the output again to input that process process of injecting some fraction of the output back to the input that process will be known as a feedback but here output voltage that is the part of fraction of output voltage is connected through feedback resistance capital r back to the inverting terminal that will be shown by the negative sign back to the inverting terminal then which feedback was uh, which feedback was produced uh, which feedback was finding us that is there are the two types of the feedback one is the positive feedback and other is the negative feedback in positive feedback that is the output and the feedbacking fraction that is the input are came in same phase that will be known as a positive feedback and in positive feedback the amplitude addition will be formed in case of negative feedback that is the uh, that is the phase of input and output are 180 out of phase ek meka chal virodhat astil tar input positive half cycle madhe asel output negative ta half cycle madhe asel how much phase difference was observed here 180 out of phase and if the input and output came 180 out of phase that feedback will be known as an uh, uh, that is the negative feedback and in negative feedback we see that there will be subtraction process of the subtraction of the amplitude will be performed here the output will be fading back to the inverting terminal that will be shown by the negative sign means which type of the feedback was uh, finding here that is the negative feedback because the uh, that is that is the voltage which was uh, uh, which was uh, uh, connected at the inverting terminal and the output are came out of phase that is 180 out of phase and hence the negative feedback was achieved here by connecting the output voltage back to the inverting input terminal okay this circuit is very 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 simple that is rc factor is used we know that that is the if the resistance and capacitor are, are connected in series that circuit will be known as a time constant circuit because that is the time means the voltage amplitude across the capacitor will be depend upon e raised to minus t divided by capital rc that is exponential quantity that is the voltage across the capacitor it will be exponentially increases with respect to time with the ratio minus t divided by r into c where r and c are the magnitude of the resistance and capacitor respectively okay it means that exponential e raised to time t divided by r by c is the time constant and that time constant it will be depend upon the series values of the resistance and capacitor here that is the circuit is started with the capacitor and ending with the resistance okay and uh, the feedback is connected back to the inverting terminal means the negative feedback was achieved if with the rc with the rc means the resistance and capacitor rc constant if the negative feedback if the negative feedback was achieved the operation of the differentiations differentiation or differentiator was performed differentiator जर आपल्याला परफॉर्म करायचं असेल डिफरेंशिएटर म्हणून आपल्याला ऑपरेशनल एम्पलीफायरला जर यूज करायचं असेल तर सर्किट मध्ये जरा बारकाईने बघा द सर्किट इज स्टार्टेड विथ द सी एंडिंग विथ द आर एंड आउटपुट इज कनेक्टेड बॅक टू द इनपुट दैट इज द इनवर्टिंग इनपुट टर्मिनल थ्रू रेजिस्टेंस आर मींस दैट व्हिच फीडबॅक वाज अचीव्ड नेगेटिव फीडबॅक वाज अचीव्ड एंड इफ सच अ सर्किट इज डिझाइनड दैट सर्किट विल बी यूज्ड एज अ differentiator it is used to perform the mathematical operation of differentiation okay see the simple equivalent uh, circuit that will be shown in diagram b 
in diagram b this is the voltage that is the voltage amplitude it will be starting with the positive and the negative will be earthed earthed or grounded here it will be it will be shown here if this is the grounded okay uh, circuit will be starting with the capacitor ending with the resistance and output voltage that is the v0 amplitude it will be connected back to the inverting terminal through resistance r and if the voltage is passing through resistance r current is produces and that current is here mentioned as the i capital i is the current here capital i is the current here the capital i is the current see the perform uh, see the operation how it will be work as a uh, differentiator differentiator it means the rate of change of two physical quantity for simplification consider the displacement uh, the displacement and time if the displacement is changing with respect to time that will be known as a velocity v is equal to dx by dt that is the velocity and that velocity is a rate of change of displacement with respect to time this operation is known uh, in mathematics it will be known as a differentiation see here the input signal source of the voltage is the vt amplitude is the vt that is the voltage amplitude at a time instant of a t we are measuring the time and with respect to time we are going to measure the amplitude that is the vt vt is connected to the inverting input terminal through the capacitor capacitor is the starting impedance ending impedance is the resistance here the non inverting input terminal is earthed just i said that non inverting terminal is earthed if the non inverting terminal is earthed inverting terminal acts as the visual ground visual ground means visually it acts as the it, it 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 acts as the input voltage zero volt means it will be acts as the earth earth means it will be also act like parallelly the ground okay see here friend the negative feedback is given back through the resistance that is v0 is connected back to the uh, inverting input terminal through resistance r and negative feedback uh, is uh, achieved here again let vt is the signal hold that is the pulse signal means the pulse that will be measured with respect to time then then the varying current will be passed through the capacitor we know that if the pulse will be started from 0 to t consider 5 second it will be ranges the time will be varying from 0.5 1 1.5 2 2.5 3 in this way the time is varying but with variation of the time voltage amplitude is also varying voltage amplitude is varying but across the capacitor it will be varies exponentially in time constant ratio means exponentially e raised to minus t divided by rc where rc is the product of the capacitor and resistors or the magnitude of the capacitor and resistor that will be connected in this circuit here c is the magnitude of the uh, capacitor that is the c is the capacity and r is the resistance it it, it will be uh, measured in terms of the ohm okay from the equivalent circuit i i calculate karaycha aplyala maithe hai golden rule ohms rule vaparaycha v is equal to i r what about the i i is equal to v is equal to i r i is equal to v divided by r voltage divided by resistance pan itha ka ye itha ka ye time constant hai exponential hai and i is equal to c into dv by dt but v v is the voltage amplitude at the respective time instant t itha kay mahatvach hai time instant mahatvach hai time instant vadla ki exponentially te vadat jail udaharnat mi tumhala thodas pen getoy mi लक्षात येईल कन्सिडर दिस इज दी ग्राफिकल रिप्रेझेंटेशन ऑफ द व्होल्टेज अँप्लिट्यूड विथ रिस्पेक्ट टू टाइम विथ रिस्पेक्ट टू टाइम ओके अँड व्होल्टेज अँप्लिट्यूड विथ रिस्पेक्ट टू टाइम अक्रॉस द कपॅसिट इट विल बी इन्क्रीजेस एक्सपोनेन्शियली ॲज द टाइम इज व्हॅरीज ॲट द सेम टाइम व्होल्टेज अँप्लिट्यूड अक्रॉस द कपॅसिटर इज व्हेरिंग इट विल बी चेंजेस जसा जसा टी वाढेल तो सो वोल्टेज अक्रॉस कैपेसिटर सुधा वाढेल वी नो दैट कैपेसिटर इज द वन टाइप ऑफ बैटरी सिंपली इट इज वन टाइप ऑफ बैटरी बट व्हेन व्हेन इट विल बी एक्ट्स एक्ट्स इन मोड ऑफ चार्जिंग 
there are the two mode of the capacitor one is the charging and another is the discharging again charging again discharging and we know that in ramp oscillator that is the uh, in case of the ramp oscillator or the uzt as the relaxation oscillator aplyala mahite apan कपैसिटर से अक्रॉस से जो कहे वोल्टेज है तो एक्सपोनेंशियली कैसा चेंज होता है विथ रिस्पेक्ट टू टी अन्य तो टाइम कांस्टेंट और कैसा डिपेंडेंट है माइनस टी डिवाइडेड बाय आर इनटू सी वर्ती कैसा डिपेंडेंट है तो बजट ले ले अन्य करंट अक्रॉस द कपैसिटर इज इक्वल टू कपैसिटी इनटू इनट voltage at a time instant t that's a derivative with respect to time dt that was c it is a bar kind of a gamut rano we see calculate kelly like sorry i calculate kelly like i is equal to c into dvt divided by dt output voltage ka sl ray v is equal to golden rule opera v is equal to ir when it upon the feedback at negative feedback and negative feedback when you hold it's a sign guy in a ray minus in a मुझे v is equal to का है ना minus मुझे v is equal to minus i आ रहे हैं ना मुझे ये तो v जो रोज़र में output voltage consider के ला तोर output voltage v जो रोज़र consider के ला तोर minus i आ रहा ला i चली कहीं i ची कीमत वर्ची put up के ला मैं round के लेती minus r into c into dv t divided by dt simply यार relation करो भगा अन्य मला है संगा what about the dvt divided by dt and here is the differentiation of the two quantities and which are that two physical quantities one is the voltage at a time t and other is the time t we are taking the differentiation of the voltage with respect to time that is the dvt divided by dt dvt divided by dt that is the rate of change of voltage if with respect to time and that is the differentiation and here here the differentiator that is the operational amplifier can perform the mathematical operation of the differentiation upon the derivative karto sign so cos cos minus sign such a type of such a type of uh, such a type uh, in this way in mathematical way we are taking the differentiation of the signal vt vt signal jo hai output la wala jo v0 mail to output la v0 asnar hai to ka asnar hai minus rc into dvt divided by dt that is here we are going to perform the differentiation of the input signal differentiation of the input signal thus the output voltage is the time derivative of the input voltage Output voltage is the time derivative of the input voltage. Means here we perform the mathematical operation of the differentiation. And in one last la ending la statement hai. here in this way operational amplifier can work as differentiation or a differentiator. This question will be asked for the short note that is uh, explain in brief the operational amplifier as a differentiator you are explained in brief the working of the op amp as a differentiator you are explain how the the operational amplifier can be worked as the differentiator kutlai language madhe question yeil answer ekas hai process of differentiation mathematical process of differentiation apan kashi perform karto hai ti aplyala ithe explain karta hai okay friends you understand it well mana Friend, Dipti, you understand in well manner the function of the differentiator or how the operational amplifier can be worked as the differentiator. You understand? Please reply. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay, okay, Dipti. Next operation, that is next and last application of the operational amplifier, and uh, that will be the very interesting application. That is, uh, uh, the, that operation will be against the differentiation. And against the differentiation, which application? That is the integration. That is, operational amplifier is the integrator. Here, just I am taking the lesser operational amplifier. Up amp as an integrator, the following diagram will be shown. 
that is operational amplifier how it will be worked as the worked to perform the process of the or the operation of the integration in mathematics in mathematics we know that the sign of the integration that will be in this way here i will be uh, i will uh, write here on a, a ppt that will be this will be the integration side and how that process will be performed by the differentiator it will be shown here uh, this is the diagram a just we changed just we changed the place of the capacitor and resistance in differentiator capacitor is the starting and resistance is the ending but here see that the starting impedance is the resistance and ending impedance is the capacitor only the places of the capacitor and resistance are interchanged if we interchange the place of the capacitor and resistance in a differentiator we can fabricate we can we are uh, going to uh, fabricate the the design of integrator just replace the place of capacitor and resistance then other remaining diagram will be as it is remaining designing will be as it is keep at is as it is only change the place of resistance and capacitor here the resistance is the uh, initial impedance the capacitor is the final impedance here output will be connected back to the inverting terminal through the capacitor here the current uh, in uh, in, uh, in uh, differentiator current is the differentiation and in uh, integrator the current across capacitor is the integration just under, understand it is very simple change this change the location change the plus of capacitor and resistance okay see ya that is the operational amplifier working as the integrator and here the output voltage is proportional to the time integral magashi derivation with the derivative or the differentiation with respect to time hota is the kai hai that is integration with respect to time hai. that is there are the two physical quantity again that is the voltage and the time and if we take the integration of the voltage with respect to time that will be known as an integrator that that is the uh, application mathematical application of the integration here the diagram b will be shown it will be simplified the starting is the resistance and ending is the capacitor okay see here here the input current is the ideal ideal zero hai katar visual ground hai baka inverting uh, non inverting terminal ground la jodlela cha ani non inverting terminal jar ground la jodla tar inverting up of visually ground hota mhanje tyacha voltage hai te zero hota ani ita mi thoda sa maza video move karto hai mitrano okay see here what about the output voltage output voltage v is equal to ir ani i kay hoil ita sanga r manje fakt capacitor hai ani capacitor sa reciprocal of the capacitor it will be worked as the resistance and integration of the it ita negative feedback hai negative feedback hai manje minus sign ala v0 is equal to minus 1 upon c integration of i dt and what about i i is equal to v divided by r ani i chi value v divided by r put up kara total relation kay hote baka just i am showing by the red pen what is the important relation it will be the final relation this is the final relation that is the v0 is equal to minus 1 upon rc rc time constant baka shi guna karat hota ita ata to bhaga karat alela hai that is the that is the reciprocal process hai reciprocal process hai 1 upon rc integration of v dt that is here integration of the voltage with respect to time and integration of voltage with respect to time is the process of the integration that is the process of the mathematical integration therefore here the operational amplifier can be used as the integrator it is used to it is used to perform the process of the integration okay friends here we studied both the application of the operational amplifier as a integrator as well as the differentiator uh, read in home i am sending all the notes in uh, uh, your google classroom okay please first uh, submit your final attendance because the time is soaring uh, only 2 minutes are required uh, remaining please submit your attendance in chat box
if you have any confusion about these two application that is the integrator and uh, differentiator then please ask me i can rectify your doubt okay please ask me if you have any doubts you have any confusion in this both application sakshi are you present here yes sir okay you have any doubt no sir okay submit your attendance prathamesh today you are present okay nikhil patil yes sir you have any doubt no sir okay fastly submit your attendance first and ask me if you have any doubt rupali rupali yes sir ha uh, sir all submitted the attendance ha uh, sir okay you if if you have no doubts then i will end the meeting prajakta sir i will end the meeting yes sir okay friends have a nice day stay home stay safe thank you हे रेकॉर्डिंग पण केले असते